<sighs> okay. This might be the uh, ultimate basket case scenario of a project car. Those in the know will know what it is. It is a, uh, or what it should be. Besides half a pan, it's a 1974 Super Beetle. One interesting one on this car is it has two places to mount the lower control arm, which is unusual. It's a, uh, well, that turns now for some reason. I don't remember the turning. Must have been the, uh, 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 that don't do anything though. Yeah, the scenes as you can tell, it's uh, been sitting in just the grass and rusting away. It's, you can tell, which just kind of stinks because there was a brand new pan section. Anyways, it was free. I guess that's the good thing. My friend bought it as like it is in a million pieces. And then he's like, just didn't care anymore to get rid of it. And so I was like, yeah, okay. And here's the body. That is not the window to it. It's for an earlier car. Anybody need that? You might find out a marketplace. Anywho. So. It's not that bad. I need to grease this door. Because it's sticky. But I'll show you the other side. It's, it's kind of in good shape. <laughs> Except for. This is how everything is. This just parts and pieces everywhere. And some of it's missing. Let's see here. Well, this one's a little frozen too. But the door. Woo. Door is nice and tight. It's green. I don't like green cars. I'm one of those weirdos that thinks they're bad luck. Somebody started painting it after they did some bad body work. The dash is actually, minus spiders, is in pretty good shape. All the fence are good. So, only oh, other thing though is, uh, what do you call those people? Uh, tweakers? Yeah, tweakers got inside the lot it was being stored at. And cut all the wiring out of it, too. It's just to make my job that much easier, I guess, you know. Who wants to deal with wiring a car or having wires in your car? I guess I'll just uh, wire straight from the battery and drive around like that, I guess. No. There was a second, like, at first I was like, holy, you know what, and stuff. Thank you, YouTube. We can't... My God, there's a dome light in it. You know how rare those are right now? Like, back order from China. Anyways, and I wish I would have seen that earlier because I needed that for another car. Oh well. I don't know if it would have came out anyways. So at first I was like, ugh. What did I get myself into? But then the same nice friend was like, hey, this old man's got this sitting around. So now I have a hood that I was missing. This one's a 73. Early too. I just picked these up for 100 bucks for all four of them. So, And I like them. I know you think they're ugly. I know what you people think. So now I got that. And when I talk about bod bad body work, it's just like... Just pile the bondo on it, you know? You don't need to be good at it. Just use more. That'll make it work. This one has some serious rush issues on its own. This door is foobarred. That hinge is no longer a hinge. This one has a wiring in it, though. This is the steering wheel out of the other car, so I need to move this one. And it also has the missing rear suspension that is under my friend's thing at the moment, but still. I mean, need some 73 seats. I don't think I'm going to use them. It's got part of the carpet in here, which I could use to make a pattern. And uh, make you one, too, if you want. I didn't realize it. Oh, the door panels are that great. It's got seat belts in it. It's got a bus mirror in it for some reason. But, hey, it's still got the wiring harness in it. It's pretty well intact I think it's speak or and, and they did something they uh, did this which at first like oh I like chip, but then I'm like hmm I always wondered if speakers fit in there now I can now I know so I might chop up my car up oh, these move I put these in the other car no transmission in this one that one has a transmission it's laying on the patio there's the fourth hubcap. So, but then there's this. 
Yeah, you know the first thing you want to do when you start working on your car is uh, sand all the paint off it and then give up. Oh, I got a back window too. So yeah, there you go. Yeah, first thing you want to do, especially if it's got rust down here, because you don't want that rust to get lonely. So the first thing you should do is make sure you sand all the rest of the paint off of it. But let's go check the other side. I don't see any rust here. Oh, up here we go. Is that a hole? Yep, that's a hole. I'm going to see my finger through it practically. Anyways, let's check the other side because as you can tell, ooh, typical super bottle. Super bottle, yeah, super bottle. Super beetle. Yep, yep, yep. Why we stuck foam in there? I have an idea though. Because I want to go maybe go rally car like the Europeans do. So I might just cut that out and put my own vent to like jam air into the engine department. Oh, look, I can hook up the computer still. Do some diagnostic on this engine. Anyways, ah, oh, you're funny, not. Look, charcoal canister, in case you've never seen one. That's a different one. Might have the square one. Let's check the rust on the side besides. Oh, that's good. That's a good sign. Somebody's already started doing body work, I think. Which means there's probably some rust hidden under there. Oh, there. No, that's boogers. Or bird. B bird butt boogers. Yeah, that's so. I don't know. So maybe. Maybe. Oh, that's a sign right there since there's bond over that hole. Yeah, but there you go. Like, definitely. I don't know if this door opens. Hey, this door opens not too bad. That seat is horrible, except it's got these quick... What the heck? That is some funky interior. So this thing's been recovered a couple times. How's the dash on this one? That works. Yep, just broke that one. Uh, these are broke. This bit all right, that I do need. But yeah, okay. So it looks like I could probably make one out of the two, and then uh, if you guys need any stuff, let me know. You'll have to come to Phoenix to get it, though. I'm not going even for like one visor, one visor. It's going to break, it's going to break, it's going to break. Can I save the headlight? <laughs> Just joking. Anyways, that's it. Thought I'd give you a peer of what I got. And like I said, I we call this one the ultimate project car since it's not much of a car. Ooh, big giant holes. Okay, okay, like, subscribe, and actually don't do any of that. I don't really care. Comment, like, subscribe on videos you care about. So, I don't really care about that. So, see ya.